Welcome all to the first ever Titleist Iron Review on Golf Box TV. And I'm pretty excited about it because look. So we're looking at the new 2019 Titleist T-Series, which contains the T100, the T200, and the T300. Three different irons targeting three different kinds of golfers. It's time to say goodbye to the Titleist AP range. It's sad, but unfortunately we're leaving it at the train station and we're riding on into the sunset with this new Titleist T-Series. Today, our full attention is on the Tour Level T100 iron. It was first equipped by Spieth at the Open at Royal Port Rush and other tour players, but she is an absolute beauty. I've got to say, out of all the three irons, this one for me still carries that AP range DNA in the iron, even though the name has changed. The other two, I can't say the same because they look completely different from a shelf appeal point of view. So let's dive straight into the tech. We've got a 1.8 millimeter thin face, which is gonna to equate to faster ball speeds. I'm gonna to have to put my teeth in for this one. We've got a co-forged dual density tungsten, uh, which optimizes the iron's stability. To improve that club to turf relationship, we have got a cambered sole, and all that is fitted on this fully forged cavity construction. So if I hold this, guys, make sure you subscribe. That feels mint. Oh! Subscribe anyway, that would be fantastic, but wow. The good news is, the lofts are extremely modest. This is a seven iron and it's 34 degrees, so it's on the right side of traditional seven iron lofts. Nothing too strong, but that's what you'd expect from this type of target market, which is a better player. The thing I really like about this is the aesthetics at address. It's thin top line, limited offset, and it allows this iron to be filtered in with the CB and MB, so we can have a split set. Love a good split set. Okay, if this goes in, everyone's got to comment their thoughts on this iron. Actually, if this doesn't go in, everyone's got to comment their thoughts on this iron. That makes more sense. It's very, very soft. And it, I'm not saying it doesn't look it, it does, but it's obviously a cavity. But it feels forged, it feels very soft. We've got the backspin, we're up at 7,000 RPM. What more do you want from this sort of iron? So we're gaming the True Temper AMT S300, which is the stock steel option. Um, and then we've got the Tenzai White AM2, which is the stock shaft for all you graphite-ites. As far as looking down at it is concerned, it is an absolute delight. Obviously that's personal preference, but if you like thin, thin things, this is gonna be right up your street. If you want more veggies behind the ball, you're gonna to have to be looking at the T200, the T300. But Titus are actually calling this whole visual package the Tor Preferred Shape Profile, which consists of progressive blade length, low offset, thin top line matching that of the CB, so it doesn't stand out like an elephant in a row of mice. All those things that basically mean it's www.compact.com.au. Don't click that URL, even if it is one, I've not researched where that goes, okay? Enough of the verbal explosion. Let's hit a few more shots um, and see how she fares in the air and also the reaction on the ground. And then we'll have a look at the numbers. I do expect some right to left spinach because I could draw a tennis ball with a hammer. Love it. Big question is, are we gonna hold one? Of course we are. And that could be it. Get in. Go, 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 go. Nope. Ugh. I love this iron. <laughs> I really do love this iron. That's got a chance. Now it's got to go again. I'm calling it far too early. I don't feel like I can miss. Love days like that. Never happens. Especially on the golf course. Look at that spin. It's 
Same noise, same feel. Rain on me. That wasn't. That was low on the face. Thin it to win it, gonna be short. Oh, ruined it. But when you hit it, oh. Ooh. I've got to admit, that's really made me think if these are going to go in the bag or not. They felt wonderful. And here we go. So it's, a, it's everything we want to see. Clubhead speed, obviously this is not going to break any distance records. It's not designed for that. We just need that ripper meh. And we've got it there. 7,000 backspin is all we really care about at the end of the day. The side spin obviously comes with that. We've got that right to left equating to an average of 653 left. But I think these irons are fantastic. They aren't going to be for everyone. Nothing is for everyone. It's all personal preference at the end of the day. But guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Just a quick look at the T100 irons. Remember, toe to toe, comment down below what you would like to see this up against. So follow us on social media. The links are below. And of course, hit subscribe and that bell. Flipping bell. Cheers.